can hold it. Dad said I can hold it. Uh, but it's my turn. No, it's not. Dad. Dad. Give me that. Hey, listen up. Now, I don't want to hear another peep out of you kids for the rest of the day. You hear me? Remember, this is supposed to be your daddy's big day now. So don't ruin it by scaring away all the deer. Dad, how much longer till we get to deer heaven? We'll get there when we get there. And uh, don't tell your mother I'm taking you kids to deer heaven on Father's Day. Why not? Because your mother probably wouldn't approve. Plus, you know how she hates fun. <laughs> yeah. She can be a real pain in the ass sometimes, right, Dad? Hey, you better watch it. That's your mother, you hear? Where in the hell did you learn to talk like that? Huh? Don't answer that. Ooh, Dad. Can we keep the deer we find in deer heaven? Sure, honey. Um, you know, after they go to deer heaven, you can do whatever you want with them. Yay! <laughs> this is gonna be better than any macaroni beer koozie your kids have ever made me. Dad, you didn't say we'd be hurting the deers in deer heaven. Oh, don't worry, honey. We won't. We're gonna kill them. They won't feel a thing. Dad, but my teacher Mrs. Smith says that the American wildlife population is in a state of depression. We should be helping them, not harming them. <laughs> oh, Mrs. Smith's love life is in a state of depression. You see the way she was scarfing down those turkey legs at the county fair last week? Fucking hypocrite. Now, son, I told you to stop listening to that airheaded liberal. You want to eat tonight, right? We're going to eat them? <laughs> Ugh. Can we just get McDonald's instead? Heather, stop that crying. You're scaring away three months of groceries. <laughs> hey, sweetie. Uh, calm down. You know, this is a good life lesson for you. Now, how do you think that chicken ends up on your plate every night? <laughs> Mommy buys it from the market, which came from some factory farm in China. Straight up capitalism. No. Well, maybe. I don't know. The point is, I mean, someone had to send those chickens to chicken heaven so you can have a full belly every night. It's the circle of life, pumpkin. Now come on. Let's get set up over here. A wimbo it, a wimbo it, a wimbo it, a wimbo it. Ugh. Dad, I'm bored. We've been out here for hours. And we haven't seen anything yet. Quit your whining, boy. It's only been 30 minutes. Plus, we just saw that family of ducks a while back. Yeah, that you wanted to brutally murder for no reason. No reason? Now, those are some healthy-looking ducklings. Mm. They would have been a real nice in my dear student out. Mm. Dad, if you wanted to shoot something so bad, we could have just went to the gun range for Father's Day. Ugh, no. Now this is a real man's playground. If I wanted blue balls, I would have went to the day shift at the mall strip club. You mean lucky tassels? Next time, Dad. Next time. Oh, <gasps> Kids, look! Look at that majestic beauty. All right, kids. Say your prayers before we take it down. Here we go. Shoo, shoo. Run, Mr. Deer, run. Be free. God dang it, Gunther. What the hell you do that for? Dad, he had a family who loved him. We can't kill it. What if that deer and his family tried to kill me? 
How would you feel? I'd be grateful. I mean, come on, son. Don't tell me. You're getting mushy on me, too. At least your sister. I always knew it would end like this. My own children. On Father's Day. I wouldn't want it any other way. Dad, no. I don't want to kill you. I just want you to stop senselessly killing these animals. Promise me you'll stop and we can all change to a healthier plant-based lifestyle. Ugh, no. Let's just get this over with. Thanks, kids. Ah! Hey, look, Dad. We did it. Yay! Yay! Hello!